Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kaylee. If you are new here, then um, this is my channel. <laughs> um, so today I thought I'd film a video, finally, and I am going to be doing a try on haul but I also have a few other bits that like aren't clothing but I'll also be showing that I have purchased recently. The background up here has changed. I got this from, well, it's all three are from Primark. They're candles, that's like a calendar thing. I don't know, I saw it, I was like, that's cute. So I got that recently. And then um, this is just a bit of a mess that I'm working on, putting on the wall, but work in progress. I've got a huge TV I wanna put on the wall, but as I said, it's not quite happened yet. So the first thing I've bought is what I'm wearing currently. It is just a black bodysuit and it's strappy from I Saw It First. And this was five pounds and I got it in a size six. And the only thing I would say is the sizing on I Saw It First is a bit odd because I went to buy a pair of jeans from there that were also a size six, completely too big for me. And this bodysuit, it's not too small, but it's tight. Like, it probably won't fit me in a couple months. But for five pounds, you can't really complain too much. So, oh well. So I then got the same bodysuit in two more colors, which I haven't tried on yet. And they still have the label on but I didn't see the point in trying them on if it's the same style. But as you can see, it's just like a plain bodysuit, strappy, slightly lower back, but not anything major. So yeah, I really like this color. This is the rose cami bodysuit. And yeah, I saw this color and I was like, wow, that's a very nice color. So yeah, the quality is also really good and they're not see-through, so very good for five pounds. And then the other colour I got the bodysuit in is red because red has just been like my favourite colour this year I'd say. Like I've just worn red throughout the year and same style, really good quality still. I'm slightly concerned about this one. It looks a little bit see-through but oh no it doesn't really. It's a very nice, um, I think it's the jersey style material. And yeah, it's very comfy, not itchy. And yeah, I really liked it in the red. Also got a pair of black jeans from Zara. And um, yeah, I was, I'm at that really awkward phase in life where like nothing fits anymore. So I had to go out and buy like a lot of new clothing because all of my jeans ripped. And yeah, all my leggings started to rip and I was just like, Okay, because I was always a four in bottoms and like, <laughs> I know it's like not really a big deal moving up to a size six, but like, then I tried on the I saw it first jeans and they were a six and they were too big. So then I was like, how am I not a four or a six? But then I thought, it's probably just their sizing. So I thought, I'm going to go up town and find a pair of jeans and like try them on there to like ensure they do fit before buying them this time. So yeah, I bought these from Zara, really comfy, stretchy, and I forgot what they're called. I think they're jeggings, but like, they feel like jeans look like jeans, basically are jeans, just called jeggings. So yeah, really like these, and these were 19 99 and yeah, I just really like them. The next thing I bought from I Saw It First is a jacket and I saw this on the website because I was looking for like the new in and this was like one of the first things I saw and I really liked it. So it's like a denim jacket and it's in this really nice stone colour and the buttons are really like, like they move a lot but... It's really comfy, it's slightly oversized which is really nice and I just think it goes with quite a lot but it's also quite like unique and different. Like I've not really seen many people with a denim jacket of this colour. So yeah, it has like all the 
buckle details on the wrist and the quality is very very good as well and I got this in a size small and this was £25. Okay so I got one thing from Primark and um, I don't really buy much clothing in Primark but I saw this and I did really like it. So it's this blackened cream jumper and it's cropped and it's like a knitted material and I really like the cuffed sleeves and like it's quite fitted but not really fitted where it's like itchy and like tight so I really like that about it and the quality does feel very good and I think it would be good in the winter new improved sizing apparently um, I got this in the size 2XS or like 2 extra small and that says it's a UK 4 to 6 like that's the conversion okay moving on to pretty little thing which I buy most of my clothing from for sure as you can tell by this haul um, I've been liking bodysuits quite a lot recently so um, you've got two more bodysuits so this is the first one from pretty little thing and it's a is it bardo when it's off the shoulder? Yeah, off the shoulder. And it's like a, um, I think this is the flute sleeve type thing. So yeah, it's really tight here. And then it goes out like about here, I think it is. You'll see in the try on clip anyway. And then yeah, it's just a normal bodysuit that clips off. It's really hard to show here. Like you can't really see what's going on. But yeah, I really, really liked this and it looks amazing tucked into jeans or a denim skirt or anything. You can really dress it up, dress it down, you know. This was £8 and I got it in a size 6. So then the next thing I bought was this nude bodysuit and it's really creased. I should have ironed this stuff, but oh well. And it's got like a white trimming around the edge. I think it's sort of like the sports piping. I've seen that in quite a lot of things and I really like the style so yeah it's this really nice nude shade and I didn't think it would suit me but I bought it anyway like just to try it like you can always return it at the end of the day and it does really suit me um well I think it does anyway I really like it on and um it's quite low but not too low and then it's quite good material it's a bit see-through and this was £7.20 because I got like uni days or something and I got it in a size 6 I believe next thing I got was a pair of pyjamas <laughs> from Pretty Little Thing but they're really nice pyjamas because I really want to like revamp my pyjama drawer because I literally just wear like boys tops and shorts and they're comfy and everything but like I just want some cute pyjamas so I bought these and it's red silk pajamas and it's got like spaghetti strap here and this is like a um, cropped cami top um, it's very loose and like cozy and it's very good material it's not see-through at all and the color is just stunning so yeah I really like this matching shorts which are quite like long considering like at the back they're very long but I guess that makes it quite like a bit more age appropriate as well so I'm not really too upset by the fact that they're long and it's got like an elastic -y waist so if you've had a um, big dinner it's okay. I got this set in a UK size 6 and this was £13.50 because I had uni days discount again. Okay, so the final clothing item I bought again from Pretty Little Thing is some jogging bottoms because I've not really got any like fashionable jogging bottoms I've got like grey ones I wear to bed and I've got a pair of pink ones from adidas but yeah they're a bit um big so I wanted some tight joggers so I got these once again red and um yeah I really like the detailing down the side it's sort of like a stitched effect down the side and um, it's got cuffs at the bottom and it's a tie up waist. I got this in a UK size 6. Uh, these were £13.50 which is really good for joggers of like this quality and I can just really see myself getting a lot of use out of these so 
yeah. Okay, now moving on to other bits that I've bought recently. I think I have like a shopping addiction and I was on Beauty Bay just scrolling through and I saw like sale and that's like my favourite word. So I clicked on it and the Manium UA Life's a Drag palette was on sale and it was reduced to £23 something. I'll put the exact price in. I don't know if the sale is still on but if it is I definitely recommend going and getting this palette and um, I love it so much. I've got it on my eyes today. It's so pigmented but it's just the colours are incredible and they swatch so well. The two shimmers are incredible and yeah every colour is just amazing and I'll definitely get a lot of use out of this palette and the, it has a mirror in it which is really nice and yeah well worth my money. The next thing I bought is the Mario Badescu spray and um, yeah I really really like this. I bought it recently, I can't even remember when but already going quite low. And then the last thing that I bought recently is a Anastasia Beverly Hills lip gloss and I got it in the shade butterscotch. This was 15-ish pounds with Beauty Bay discount. So also smells like butterscotch as well. Okay, so that's all I have to show for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you're new here, please, please subscribe to my channel. If you have any video requests, please leave them below. Um, like and comment on this video if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you again shortly for another video. Bye.